Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Ocho Reacts and listen, alright man, it is Saturday night, okay, I, we, I had the party of the year yesterday, I'm not gonna lie to you, so I'm down an eye, alright, I'm down a shirt apparently, alright, obviously not that one, alright, shout out to my, shout out to my uni, but um, you know, it's, it was, it was a night, okay, it was a night, my house is still somewhat of a mess, okay, but we are here, we are here ladies and gentlemen, we are here on the final day, at least here in the, honestly, if you're celebrating wherever you are in the world, of Hollow Weekend, because Baby Monster has returned to us. And uh, of course, they really captured my imagination last comeback, um, really actually two comebacks ago, um, but Forever was, you know, it was, it was, it was, it was hitting. I just really was hating y'all remember the reaction. But um, we got Click Hack. We're going to do a double feature, all right? We got the rare double feature on the show today, ladies and gentlemen. We got Click Clack and we got Drip because I heard Click Clack leads in the Drip. So that's why I kind of waited on that. So here we are, back to back, baby monster. I'm here to see Asa and Ruka probably do a madness. I did listen to the album, by the way. Um, what is it? Woke Up in Tokyo? Fire. Fire. Glad they included that. I think they showcased that at some of like, the different showcases or like concerts. So uh, really cool they included that. But yeah, let me know what your favorite off the project was. And yeah, as always, remember to like, share, and subscribe. You guys enjoy the content. And as always, all right, let me know what you thought about the MV and song. And yeah, let me know um, if there's a song or group you guys want me to check out. As you think I haven't checked out before, and if I haven't, I will add it to the queue. But without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, it is Baby Monster. They have been Baby Monster so far in their careers. Let's see what they're talking about today. Click, clack, bang. I that way too. Hey. I like the black and white. Talk to Alfredo. This rap line is this, this, you know, I, I mean, it's YG, right? So we should know, we should know, we should know. But let me just say, all right, I didn't expect, even though I did hear rumblings, um, I managed to avoid all spoilers for both these two songs, by the way. Um, I did hear this was going to be a little bit more hip hop heavy. I didn't know how much. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. I'm very much so feeling this. feels almost, um, the rap line is giving me XG vibes, which is the highest compliment I can really give a female rap line currently. So, uh. Yeah, and like I said, it's YG. This is what they do. You know what I mean? This, this is what they do. This is what they do. Of course, the rap line is, is going to body that. Um, Ian looks great, by the way, um, as she does, the golden girl. But yeah, let's keep it rolling. That drop is smooth. I love these, bro. All right, from like a, a director standpoint, by the way, I love, I love this shot. I love this shot in whatever format. I always wear it's like the circle of people either hooded or like facing away, and then you have them in this zoom out. Classic my music video shot, especially in in, in rap music videos as well. Um, but yeah, used a billion times. It hits every single time. Love this shot of freedom. Beautiful editing. That's hard. That, that's hard. That's so hard. This 
might be the hardest song they've ever dropped. Okay, the switch up to house. I did not expect that switch up. I ain't mad at it though. I am, not, I am not mad at it though. I did not expect that switch up though. I'm not gonna lie to you. I did not expect the little switch up there to, to we were very strongly in like a hip hop rap um, production and that switch to house the end for the, the end. This very much so was an intro though. Very much so, very much so makes sense that it was like it's the intro to the album. It's also kind of like a prelude to of course what ends up being the title track which is Drip. So uh, yeah, fits all that. But I really like the stylistic choice of the black and white um, obviously fits the grimer aesthetic that they were going with with the song and of course with the MV and just kind of them providing it with the delivery. I guess everybody in the group can rap, which I guess, you know, YG things. Again, the XGism of, of Baby Monster. I'm here for it. But um, yeah, everybody in the, listen. Rob, Robbie just continue, bro. She just can do no wrong in my eyes. We talked about this last uh, time I reacted to Baby Monster. She is, I mean... I don't think I have a bias. I don't think I can call a bias anymore. I, I think we are literally just in a fight and it may change MV to MV. I might just be as like, a, it might just be all seven currently. Um, Cause it just feels like there's a different member that just like stills the show every single time for me. So yeah, uh, let's keep it rolling. All right, drip, all right, drip, drip. So not an intro on it, let's get straight to it. But you should probably see the screen. You should, you should, you should probably see the screen. I should probably let y'all see that, right? All right. Oh, did the cassette have the... Ah, the cassette with the full album mode. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Cool detail. check quality check quality check yeah i felt like that was 720 and that's not enough for me starting off with the rap line is always gonna go well we're gonna look like a visual She is so tough for that. She's so tough for that. You, you so you so tough for that. Asa, you so you so tough for that. She is so tough for that. Asa is so tough for that. Y'all know I love a tag. I've said it a million times. I love a tag. I love a tag. I love a producer tag. I love a rapper tag. Let them know. Let them know you coming. All right? I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, Song-wise, though, um, actual analysis, besides me fangirling over the rap line again, um, it was very interesting to see where that build. Um, I, it could have gone a couple different ways, obviously, but I like it. I like it. It feels very, feels very what in tune with what kind of baby monster is kind of creating their sound to be um, right now. And uh, yeah, I was rocking with it. I want to I want to hear more of this, though, before I kind of give more of a concrete answer. Um, but yeah, liking it so far. Liking it so far. Obviously, the girl is about to buy this. That transition was crazy. The 
high princesses back to back. We doing all the duos. The transitions are crazy. They're so smooth. Oh my gosh, bro. That whoever edited these two videos is in their bag so much. I mean, everybody is in the the stylist has been in their bag in this entire MV. The set directors have been in their bag. The music video director has been in his bag or her bag. Just everybody in this everybody included with this is in their bag right now. But this, oh my, these transitions are so crispy. Like it's so effortless. It looks so effortless. That's I mean it's gorgeous. Like look at this, bro. The with the camera oh my gosh, bro. That was insane. Nah. Excuse me? That was I whoa, 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 whoa. She got it like that? Oh nah. Nah. Nah 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 nah. I I I mean I've I said it last I think I said it two videos ago. I understood the hype and, and why everybody was so excited about her being in this group. But if she obviously she's the hook one. She's almost like she plays you know, for staying in the YG family. She plays a little bit of the Ginny role, so she can do a little bit of everything. I already knew she was an all-arounder. If she's got vocals to do a high note of that level, her solo career is going to be insane. Her solo career is going to be insane because she does she does everything this well, this young, is crazy. We got to run that back. <laughs> That's crazy. I love this editor. Hey, hey. Yep. <laughs> yep. 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 They're here to stay. They're here to stay. They're here to stay. I know some of y'all are not going to be happy about that. Um, but <laughs> you know what? That's unfortunate for you. All right, they're here to stay, okay? Baby Monster is going nowhere, okay? They are going to be a mainstay of the fifth generation. All right, YG has done it again. All right, they have done it again. They are not going anywhere. Anywhere, okay? They're not going anywhere, except to the top. All right, they're, they're probably going to the top. Um, that I am high note, though, it has me stunned. Is there anything that she does like so she's a good she's a good performer. She's a good rapper. She's she's a good dancer, and she's apparently an incredible vocalist. And honestly, apparently the whole group can, does. Do, do do we just this? You know what? Maybe maybe it took so long for this group to drop because YG was assembling like a dream team of like trainees, and they were like, oh yeah. This is like Hogwarts. We're cooking up the best, like, idol. Like, we're going to make the seven best female idols possible. Um, which obviously is the goal of any. But this feels like on a different level. All right? This feels like a different level. Um, I feel like I'm learning that every single member of this group is an all-arounder. Um, which is kind of insane. Which is kind of insane. But yeah. Uh, Morgan's stuff from Baby Monster. The album was also, like I said earlier, very, very good stuff. And as I mentioned, they are going nowhere. All right, this group is going to be one of the top girl groups. We are going to be reacting to them. I anticipate for a very, very, very 
very, very, very long time. And uh, yeah, wishing them all the best success. Hope y'all enjoyed this. I don't know how you possibly couldn't have, whether you are, what, no matter what, if you were here for the music or the MV, I don't know how you could have not enjoyed these two. So yeah, without further ado, Ocho signing off.